did some research on that treatment you're considering. Oh, really? I mean, you don't trust my fine mm. team of specialists? No, no, no. I'm sure they know what they're doing, but I don't. And I have this annoying habit of wanting to be informed. Could we please talk about something fun? Don't I get enough of this at the hospital? Humor me. No. I'm sick. You humor me. I'm trying to humor you, but it's not easy, considering I'm the only one in your life that knows the cancer has returned. Now, are you going to listen to me or not? You're very, very pushing. That's yeah, another annoying habit of mine. Fine. Today, I am declaring a moratorium on the cancer subject. We are two intelligent, grown-up human beings. We're good kissers, and I think we ought to be able to come up with something else to discuss. All right, sweetums, what do you want to talk about? <laughs> are you looking at your watch? Good heavens, are you already finding me tedious? My company's not interested. No, well, not at all. What? Not at all, but um, I do have another appointment, and in fact, here she is now, right on time. What is going on here? Is this some kind of an ambush? I could ask the same thing. I'll see you later. Well, of all the sophomoric things a grown man to do. And yet, we both fell for it, so what does that say about us? <laughs> you wouldn't have let him get away with it. Your imagination is running wild, darling. Despite what you think, I, I do care about you. Well, but when you cut somebody off, you usually don't want to see them. I'm trying something new. I'm trying to be more understanding. You're not making it easy. So... <laughs> Speak now, or forever hold your peace. Mother? It's come back, hasn't it? Um, they found it earlier this time, thank God. <sighs> Have you... Decided on your treatment yet? Um, I mean, we're not we're not quite there yet. I have a better team of experts this time. Good. Yeah, and I'm on top of it. I'm I'm top of it. I'm I am. I'm not going to let this thing get the best of me. <gasps> it doesn't stand a chance. And um, with Mister Know It All over there, you know, I'm going to have more information and statistics. So I'm going to know more than the oncologists themselves. Brian has been overseeing your treatments. Oh, I mean, no, I mean, he's not a male nurse or anything like that. It's just, well, he's detached, you know, so I don't have to worry about his feelings. <sighs> what about mine? <sighs> I didn't want you to feel obligated. I'm your daughter. That's not an obligation. Oh, pussy cat. Pussy cat. Pussy cat. I am here, mother, and I am not going anywhere. Thank you. And I'm not either. You better not. <laughs> <laughs> so, Brian. <laughs> been confiding in him oh what what's going on there oh come on don't make this into an overly romantic situation <laughs> well he clearly cares about you mother i mean look at the lengths he went to to get us to talk to each other yeah <laughs> he's the kind of guy he has absolutely no sense of personal boundaries <laughs> and he's the kind of guy who's the best thing to come around in your life in a long time you think so <laughs> Brian? Luke, what are you doing here? I, I arranged a meeting for your mom. I wanted to see how it went. Oh, she's not here? Where is she? Well, the last time I saw her, she was with your grandmother. You, um, you look, um, are you all right? Yeah. I just need to talk to her. Uh, do you know when she'll be back? What's wrong? I got expelled from school. 
If I were still in remission, you know, it could get hotter. I'm sure. Hot. <laughs> but but <sighs> as it is now, who knows? You know? I hate to see you deny yourself any happiness because of this. Why are you being so solicitous of me? I, I thought we were having a conversation. Oh, you're not just doing this because you think I'm going to snuff. Because I'm not going to. I'm going to hang in here. I'm not going to. I'm being solicitous, as you call it. Because like it or not, you're my mother. Oh. And I love you. Oh. And I miss you. Oh, honey. Yeah. I want the whole body. I want the whole body. Oh. Oh, oh honey. I'm here now. Good. What can I oh. do for you? Oh, I know. I know what you can do for me. Yeah. yeah. What? You know what I like? I'd really like. I'd like a glimpse of my grandchildren. You're a lucky lady, because I know just where they oh, are. Oh, honey. Oh. Hey. Let's go. Okay. I love you. I love you. I was willing to fight for my ideas, Brian. And all of my ideas were completely doable, and then I just messed it all up. You can straighten it out. How? I got kicked out of school. I've lost Noah's respect. I guess that's not all I've done, is it? What do you mean? Well, isn't this the part when you tell me about all the damage I've done to the foundation? How no one's gonna wanna give to that gay kid who cheated and got caught? I don't think I need to tell you that. I think you're punishing yourself enough. <sighs> <laughs> ah! President Snyder! Hi, Brian. Hi, Mom. Did you talk to Noah? Is he coming for dinner? Uh, no, I don't think so. Hi, honey. Brian, mm. I'm surprised to see you here. Well, something tells me you're not that surprised. <laughs> Where's Ethan? Uh, the sitter took him to the park. She left a note. Can I, honey, can I catch him up? Yes, oh, absolutely. Yeah, yeah, I'd like to go with you if you don't mind. Well, what if I do mind? Listen, Luca and Lily need some time alone. <laughs> what is this, another one of your ambushes? This has nothing to do with me or you. Let's go. What's she want? Bye. And furthermore, if you pull a stunt like that on me again, you are going to regret it. I have no doubt that's absolutely true. But yes. you know what? In the meantime, you and Lily have reconciled, thanks to me. So you know what? You need me. Oh, yes, I, you think I need you, but you can't fix everything. But I can make things easier for you, oh, if you'll let okay. me. Now, don't do anything like that. I'm, please don't. I, I don't feel like it. I'm not demonstrative. I, 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 my body, my body has betrayed me, you know? I'm in no hurry. Oh, you want to wait? You want to wait for my new breasts? No, we don't know the time frame on that. Lucinda, I'm interested in you, not your breasts. <laughs> what, Laugh. What's so funny? Laugh, because laughter is healing. <laughs> <laughs> you sure know how to... You know how to sweet talk a girl. <laughs> oh... oh.